All right, YouTube, really quick, showing you guys how to do a caliper replacement for a 1975 Chevy Nova. This should fit a bunch of different vehicles, but here's a new one. Ordered this off of eBay. It said it fit the car. We'll see if that's true. But the tools you're gonna need are an 11 millimeter socket for that brake hose there. As you can see, I already have that brake hose loosened up with that 11 millimeter deep socket, but use a shallow socket because uh, you're gonna be running into that spring. I sanded off the rusty flakes and oiled it up with some penetrating oil. Any kind will do. If your car is super rusted, this might break off, but for me, I got lucky, at least on this side. So we're also going to use this Allen key. Now, do I know the exact size for this Allen key? According to my trusty bag, it states that the size is 10 millimeter. If that's correct, go for it. If not, find the right size. So you put it in the um, Allen socket and then loosen it up. That fits on the new one as well as the old one. So we're going to put it in the Allen socket. Again, I got this all loosed up, ready for you guys. So I'm not struggling on camera. Pop these out. Take this 11 millimeter for the brake hose off. There's going to be a copper washer that just fell in there. Um, the new one came with a copper washer, so that's nice. And then just get that caliper out of there. This one's seized up, so you could probably have it remanufactured or just buy another one. I think I paid less than $60 for those. In 2021. So these brake, uh, these pads are perfect. I'm gonna reuse those. And it's the old one looks like. And there's the copper thing. Anyways, that's pretty much how you. Uh, take off the caliper and you put everything on in reverse. That's pretty much self-explanatory. So you pop this on there with these bolts off and get it done. So I'm pretty sure this is very primitive to most people, but in case anyone wanted to see how it was done, that's pretty much how you do it. And here's the finished product. I will say what I didn't realize is these are oriented the left side and the right side will be stamped accordingly. Should have taken a hint from this where it says L for left. It will not put, it will not go in because that metal there, this, let's see if I can, I can't do that, can I? This will inhibit if you put the right side on the left side anyways but it does fit it does work i'm changing out the brake master cylinders that'll be another video as well so anyways if you like this video if it helped you even a little bit give it a like and subscribe thanks for watching